Penny was one that caught my eye to the blocks with Hansford next to him and Despard. So Despard now being headed by Jake Penny. Cow close to 10-3. Can he go? Penny, Despard, Hansford, Sherman. Mason next, Portelli and also Willis. The breeze looked perfect for that first heat. We'll wait for a winning time. Unofficially 10.23, we're just going to wait to see a wind reading. What a way to start High Velocity Club for this season. Jake Penny continuing on from where he left off on the Gold Coast Australian Relay Camp pre the Olympics. 10, 2, 3, 1.6 official Jake Penny climbing up the Australian rankings. So away Emily, this time Mirach was the one that caught my eye in the middle lanes. Now it's the tall figure of Fryer. Fryer and Baker it is. So Fryer, the old Melbourne, is going to street away with a beautiful win there in that B race. Behind him was probably a battle between Clark and also Kamaris. But Matthew Fryer, the 18 year old from old Melburnians, is going to go sub 11 seconds for the first time. 10.73, Matthew Fryer flying. Good start here, it was the Essen athlete in V with that powerful start from the blocks. Now Drescher joins him also, Busatil. Busatil, it is on the inside, the Key Lawson Bernards from Fry flying home late, and Matthew Parrott. Key Lawson Bernards, their win for Max Busatil's Key Lawson Bernards, men's sea race. 11 0 8, unofficial. Beautiful running. Good start from all of them. We'll look to the middle lanes and it might be the Sandringham athlete, no Rourke that's got to the front of them. But now over the top, it's gonna be the tall stride in Hankinson with Demedio out wide. Hankinson, Demedio and also O'Rourke very toast for second. Rocket Kelly squad takes the victory though in the men's D, 100 metres. Personal best continue, 11.22, we'll just wait for win reading. And another legal one, 1.6 personal best there for Zachary Hankinson of Diamond Valley.